Welcome to Music Technology. The particular lesson that I chose today is on Sibelius. Sibelius and Finale are the two music score programs that are out there that enables you to write music and then print it out. There's not too much difference between the two except for this exception. Within Sibelius there is photo score and auto score. AutoScore enables you to upload MP3s, MP4s, and change that over to written music. PhotoScore enables you to scan in the music, send it right to Sibelius, and then Sibelius is able to read that music and play it back. I think these two differences really give Sibelius a huge upswing and definitely a bigger vote as to the value to a music education and a music teacher and or student. A student can upload their music, they can upload the piano score to a piece that they're working on and play along with it instead of having to find an accompanist all the time. They can upload a piece of music, say for example, my wife is a piccolo player. If she finds a piece that's in D flat piccolo and she wants to play C piccolo, she can upload the score and then just change the key automatically. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you just how easy it is to upload um, a particular piece of music and we're going to play it and I'm going to show you how easy it is. I'm using a Mac PC, I'm using Sibelius, and I'm using just a real simple um, scanner printer combination. This was all of $39 at Walmart, so it's nothing special or nothing that most educators are going to have within their resources anyway. So, in order to upload, I'm going to bring the camera a little bit closer and I'm going to show you what's going on on the screen. As you can see, there's photo score, auto score, MIDI files and MIDI XML files. We're going to open PhotoScore. So I'm going to go down, I'm going to click on PhotoScore, and it's going to come up scan a page. Yes, I do want to scan a page. I'm going to take a standard piece of music. This is for E flat alto saxophone. It's standard repertoire that's been changed over for different instruments turn on the printer scanner get that set now I'm going to come over to the photo score application and I'm going to click scan pages scan one page it's going to bring you to a different ski screen where it says scan gear and we're just going to press scan. So right now the computer and the scanner are talking. It's warming up and it's currently reading that piece of music. Please enter a name for this scan music and we're just going to go score to page one. As you can see, the green bar indicates it's importing and it's been completely imported. So now it's going to come through and it's going to show the piece of music and I can go in and I can change it. What we want to do is we want to send it to Sibelius. So we click that, click yes. At this point we can, this is a transposing score, change the default instruments, choose instruments, or in this case we're just going to send it in to Sibelius. Now what it does have trouble is with words. If you notice on the top, it's 
doesn't make a lot of sense. So you could go in and change that. This is the original as far as words. This is what it says. But how it comes out is just absolutely, absolutely brilliant. I could go through, I can transpose it, I can do whatever I need to do. So, this is completely the differences between Sibelius and Finale. The ability to have photo score and being a able to upload music, change it on the fly, add it, um, change instrumentation, listen to it, especially for young music students in high school and college, the ability to go in and actually listen to the piece of music when they're having difficulty, listen to the piano score, being able to play along with it as they're preparing a piece of music is just completely invaluable and it gives Sibelius such a huge advantage over Finale. I thank you for your time, and I hope you're interested in using the product.